I don't oppose war in all circumstances. And when I look out over this crowd today, I know there is no shortage of patriots or patriotism. What I do oppose is a dumb war. It's time to admit that no amount of American lives can resolve the political disagreement that lies at the heart of someone else's civil war. We took our eye off the ball when we invaded Iraq. And now it's done. My job is to uh, withdraw in a responsible way from Iraq and stabilize the situation there. But our real focus has to be on Afghanistan, the border regions between Afghanistan and Pakistan. And we have to put as much pressure on them as possible. Uh, and uh, I've already you know, spoken to my national security team about how we're going to do that. Uh, and I'm confident uh, that we can keep them on the run uh, and ensure that they cannot train uh, terrorists to attack our homeland. That's my number one priority as President of the United States. How important do you think it is, Mr. President-elect, to apprehend Osama bin Laden? I think that we have to so weaken his infrastructure that whether he is technically uh, alive or not, he is so pinned down that he cannot function. Uh, my preference, obviously, would be to capture or kill him. Uh, but if we have so tightened the noose that he's in a cave somewhere and can't even communicate with his operatives, uh, then uh, we will meet our goal of protecting uh, America.